And uh, just looking at that, uh, the, the scoreline isn't really a true reflection of the game. Are, are you proud of the boys? How good was it? Yeah, obviously the scoreline is quite tough to take. Um, it's been a quite an interesting week for us, uh, but I think yeah, I'm very proud of the boys, the effort we put in. I um, also don't think it's a fair reflection and uh, really hope we could maybe get a try in. Um, but unfortunately it wasn't to be, um, but it's still been a great week, a great experience. And uh, I think we can take a lot of uh, confidence out of this, the guts the guys showed and uh, the defence we showed. It's a young Stormers team. Surely this is a great foundation, a great opportunity to have shown what you're capable of, but, but certainly a good building block for you guys. Yeah, yeah, I think it's definitely a good building block. Um, I think last week we had a bit of a hiccup in the Curry Cup, um, but just showing again the young guys coming through. Um, also, it's great to have a guy like Juan back bringing some valuable experience. Um, so I think we have a good mix, and like I said, we'll take confidence from this, although the scoreboard didn't reflect how we wanted to. Just before we come back to the game, how tough is it when you only find out like a couple of hours before the game that you're actually playing? <laughs> yeah, I think uh, although the score wasn't that great, but it's going to be an interesting week. We'll tell our kids about one day. Yeah. Uh, it's been up and down. Uh, we've been in the bubble since last week, Friday. Um, but it's been enjoyable and just uh, really great, uh, grateful to get the opportunity to play against some of the world's best. Uh, and yeah, we look forward to the Test Series uh, the next three weeks. Just looking at the makeup of the team tonight, nice to have a guy like Jean de Jong back with his experience. Yeah, like I mentioned, it's, it's been really nice having him back and he's put, uh, gave us some um, valuable input um, over the last few weeks, uh, especially with some of the younger guys and uh, especially with some of the younger backs who are really exciting. So that's been really great. Just uh, how, how frustrating is the season being? Just when you seem to get going, it comes to a grinding halt again and, and obviously the preparation into this game is tough. How, how frustrating, frustrating has it been? Yeah, I think uh, to be honest, it's, it is frustrating um, and it is definitely a bit of stop start, um, which isn't, isn't ideal. Um, but I think uh, we still have a lot to be grateful for. Um, I think, think the opportunity to play, the, the effort SA Rugby has put into play. I think there's uh, a lot of people out there in our country in the world who, who might uh, struggle a bit more. So we still have a lot to be grateful and to be able to play. Um, so although it's frustrating, I think uh, we try and enjoy it uh, and try and uh, yeah, make the most of the time we have. Super. Well, you certainly made the most of it tonight. Thanks for chatting. We kept you a bit longer because Stuart Hogg isn't available just yet. But uh, well done tonight. The score definitely wasn't a true reflection. And uh, yeah. certainly a, a strong performance. Well Thank done. Thank you, sir. Thanks, Joel.